I just need to give the city a shout. Oh, we gon' stop, we gon' stop. Welcome to my corner and welcome back to another vlog. Happy Monday! It is Monday, um, December 26th, day after Christmas. Um, and I just got back from the gym. So I'm off of work all this week. We do get a winter break from work. Um, and yeah, I'm off all this week. Also, y'all, if y'all have ever noticed this scar on my forehead, that scar has been there for a long time. I think it's from eczema. I don't know why I'm talking about this. I guess because I have my hair pushed back so I can see it. I think it's from eczema, but I'm starting to think it's from something else. But I don't know. It's bothering me. I need to just put something on it to make it lighter. Anyways, it is Monday afternoon. I just got back from the gym. I'm feeling really good. I didn't work out at all last week because I was on my period and I just wasn't feeling it. So, and my hair was fresh. I know like that's a bad habit to have, but it is what it is. But we're back in the gym. Um, I feel really good. I am doing the... 15 330 challenge where you walk on an incline of 15 a speed of three for 30 minutes now mine is moderated i cannot do 15 for 30 minutes absolutely not it's more it's giving more of an eight for 30 minutes but hey you gotta start somewhere so i did that um that was my cardio that was basically my workout and then i did a little bit of arms ab work and a little bit of lower body just a little bit because the main workout is the 15 330 so that's what i did today my camera died so i didn't get anything but me on the treadmill it's lunchtime, so i'm about to heat up some food from yesterday my stepdad made roast for christmas i didn't vlog for christmas because there wasn't really much to vlog um and then i just i don't know i like spending time with my family for the holidays like i don't feel like pulling out my camera and all of that but this vlog is probably gonna be going into next next year we're probably gonna upload this next year so yeah so one of my christmas gifts i didn't show you guys um because obviously i didn't vlog yesterday it's actually the jazz club by mason margella replica my mommy got me this um and she also got your girl an ipad okay um so that's coming in later this week i just ordered some stuff for that um and then i think i showed you guys in the last vlog that i bought this for myself yeah so actually i ordered the mason margella jazz club for myself because i didn't realize that was going to be my christmas gift i thought my christmas gift was going to be something else that i asked for but my mom said it was sold out when she looked for it so um it was some coach house shoes that i wanted so i'm gonna order those on my own and then whenever the fragrance comes in i'm gonna exchange it for something else since i already spent the money on it but yeah so today is gonna be a chill day i do not want this piece of hair sticking out the reason i put my hair in a claw clip is because i didn't want hair in my face come on now anyways today's gonna be a chill day we're gonna clean up i need to clean up my apartment really bad i need to mop this floor is disgusting like i haven't mopped in a while i don't even know when the last time I, it was i mopped but i'm gonna go ahead and make my lunch really quickly and then i have to and then i'm going to film a tiktok and then we're gonna get to cleaning i have to do what well, i have to do but i want to do an unboxing for that bag that i showed you guys um from sin bono and yeah that's what we're gonna do today what's up y'all happy wednesday i never know my days anymore happy wednesday i am about to get ready to head out i'm actually meeting a friend for coffee um because i have some things that i need to get done for kaylin's corner so we're gonna go to a coffee shop and get some work done today but i want to show you guys the fits because i feel like i look really snatched and it's probably this bodysuit so the bodysuit is skims the joggers are from meshki of course i haven't worn these in a long time but if you are not new here y'all know that i rave about meshki joggers like literally wear them all the time so you guys have on my yeezys because i just want to throw on some sneakers but we looking real cute and then we're carrying our selfiezy 
because I need everything to fit in here. So I'm about to get ready to head out. Um, I want to get something to eat. So I need to get ready to go. And then after the coffee shop, we're probably going to stop at the mall because y'all, let me show y'all. I don't even know why I picked y'all up. Let me show y'all my Uggs. Mind you, I got these last year for Christmas. Oh, it's getting a little worse. Look, they're ripped. I got these for Christmas last year. I've only had them a year and the stitching is already coming apart. And I don't even wear them that much. Like they're not even that worn. So we're gonna take those back to Nordstrom and see if we can exchange them because I'm actually very upset about it. Let's go ahead and head out because I wanna get something to eat before I get to the coffee shop. Um, I wish I could stop somewhere and like get a salad. Anyways, let's go. Wait, 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 wait for all right, y'all. Sorry I did not vlog in house in the coffee shop a lot. Um, also, this little foundation stick that I used, it's pretty orange because I'm pale right now. So, sorry. I can tell. But we're about to head to North Park. Hopefully, I can exchange these Uggs. If not, I'm going to probably have to contact the store. But I'm hoping they'll let me exchange them because Uggs just cost too much money to be ripping after a year. So I'm gonna see if they can help me. And I may stop at Zara because they're having their like after Christmas sale, but we'll see. Um, Yeah, so let's go see. Hopefully they just let me exchange them. I do not want to return them. I just want a new pair. And there's like, there's literally no way they should be ripping. But my um, I do have the receipt and they're from Nordstrom. So hopefully that works okay y'all success so i got them returned um i couldn't do an exchange because they didn't have the size that i needed they're sold out in all the eights and nines probably for the holidays of course so i just told her to put it back on a gift card because i want to exchange or if not then i could just buy something else from Nordstrom. it's cool um but i am sad though because i'm not gonna have my uggs but for 200 dollars, those boots should not be ripping like and also the camera's trying to focus on my steering wheel but yeah, for two hundred dollars, those boots should not be ripping. But why? I don't know why I didn't expect the mall to be crowded. I guess because it's Wednesday at like four o'clock. This mall is so packed. Like it's so many people at the mall. I'm like, do y'all not have to go to work? But I guess everybody's off for the holidays, like I am. So why would I expect people to have to go to work? Anyways, um, I don't have any plans for the rest of the day. Sorry, I didn't vlog in the mall, but y'all didn't miss nothing. I just got my gift card, um, and all the people that were in the mall were giving me anxiety. So I'm probably gonna go ahead and head home. Um, I do have plans tomorrow, so I'm gonna t I have dinner plans, so we'll be doing that. But other than that, like it's a really chill day today. So I'm gonna head back home. It's some stores over here I don't want to check out, but oh, I did walk in Zara, and I walked right back out. That line was absolutely ridiculous, and the store is a mess because of the sale right now. So decided against that i was like nah it's never that serious not for an 80 dollar coat it's not because i definitely want to get me like another coat um like i told you guys but it's it's not that serious i promise it's not so we're gonna go ahead and head back home what's up y'all it is thursday night and i am about to get ready to go to dinner so mickey invited me to this um upscale pizza restaurant that's that just opened not too long ago so of course I had to indulge. I know a little reason to get cute. Um, but I'm about to like touch up my hair. I shouldn't really have to do much to it. I probably just, yeah, let's see. It looks good. I'm gonna just touch up my bangs and kind of the outer portions of my of my hair. A trick for the girls that don't know if you're in a rush and you can't like curl your whole head, curl the front pieces of your head and the back will just kind of fall together. It'll look like you did something to your hair. So that's what I'm about to do because honestly i don't have a reason to cut my whole head so we're gonna do that flat iron these little pieces of um leave out real quick i actually have to film a video really quickly that i have to turn in tomorrow um I'm doing some like ugc content for a brand so i started getting ready a little bit early so that i can have time to do that the video is not gonna take me that long probably take me maybe 30 minutes if that so i'm gonna knock that out while I have makeup on because I don't know if y'all know but as a content creator when you got your makeup on me anyways I try to kill two birds with one stone because oh this not even on I try to just kill two birds with one stone because who want to do that makeup again 
when like i'm already doing it so it's just like why not go ahead and do it and do some content but anyways i'm gonna speed y'all through this process because y'all probably know how to curl hair um and if you don't then it's not that hard i promise look on tiktok and then we're gonna put our makeup on and all that and get real cute and i'll show you guys my outfit i've asked about you and they told me things but my mind didn't change and i still feel the same what's a life with no fun please don't be so ashamed i've had mine you've had yours we both know we know they won't catch you like i will my only wish is i die real because that truth hurts and those lies hell and you can't sleep thinking that he lies still so you cry still see it's all in a pillowcase big girls all get a little taste out pushing me away so i give a space out feeling with a heart that i didn't break i'll be there for you i will care for you i keep thinking you just don't know trying to run from that say you're done with that on your face girl it just don't show when you're ready just say you're ready when all the baggage just ain't as heavy and the party's over just don't forget me we'll change the pace and we'll just go slow like i feel like such a baby oh my gosh um lip gloss hold on let me show y'all the fragrance i'm wearing because y'all need to go get this i showed it to y'all in my last vlog but y'all need to go get this i'm gonna get the full size bottle of this and keep this for like date nights and stuff like that it is k ollie um invite only it smells so good like it's so sexy and you're gonna put on some of my lip gloss because I need it i've been talking and doing videos and stuff so I'm running late what's new oh my gosh okay so outfits um fragrance i already showed you guys outfit is from pretty little thing let me lower my oh baby my tripod said drop it low girl okay so this dress is from pretty little thing i'm gonna leave a link down below it's really nice it's very shapely i don't know if it's from a shape collection but it gives my body a good shape like do y'all see this look how my booty look it looks so good. Then I have on my boots from Shoe Deal. I don't know if you guys can see in that angle. Probably not. Um, and then I am wearing my matching bag that looks like a Balenciaga bag. But this is from Ego. So I look so cute. I love this. I wish I could take pictures in this, but I'm doing a reel, so that works. Anyways, your girl is going to head out because I really want to go out after. I feel like somebody needs to see me in this outfit. Like... I just need to give the city a shout. Oh, and I'm wearing my ARC watch, which I don't wear a lot because it's silver. But yeah, let's head out because like I said, I'm late. Only been a few hours, but it felt like days. Only been days, but it felt like months. Only gone for a year, only go like once. Life moves fast when you do what you want. I guess I'm doing what I want. Before. Say you miss me. Well, well, well. Forgive me. Expecting to be all on cold winter. Okay.
Okay, y'all, so we just left the restaurant. Um, the restaurant was, I'm a little lit because the margarita that they gave me had Casamigos in it and it was very strong. Um, but we just left the restaurant and so Mickey and I are actually about to head to Trappy's tonight and see what the vibes are on because I was like, I don't really wanna go home. Um, and so that's what we are about to do. But the restaurant was really, really good. It's a new restaurant. Um, I think I told y'all it's like this very, upscale pizza place it was so good so i would definitely recommend it i'm gonna put all the information on the screen so that you guys can like check it out um if you're in the dallas area it was good like the meatballs were really good um the drinks were strong it was giving they poured all the costume goes in my drink and then um the pizza was fire but yeah we're gonna have a little hopefully a little lit night get a little hookah you know and vibe out what's up y'all good morning it is saturday and we are about to head out i woke up late because i was up till freaking 3 a.m. watching the best man the final chapters um so i'm just now getting up it's almost one o'clock but we have errands to run we have to go to sephora um that's really the main errand i need to go get my headlight fixed but i'm probably not gonna vlog that because like y'all don't need to see that but i need to do that and then i need to get my eyebrows done but y'all know where we're about to go it's saturday and just because i'm a little bit of a crackhead a lot of a crackhead we're going to starbucks so um, I'm gonna take you guys with me, of course, and yeah, we're about to make an exchange at Sephora, and then I don't know where the rest of the day is gonna take us. So for New Year's, we're not doing anything. We're gonna turn up in the, at the crib at the safety of our homes. But I don't know if I'm gonna vlog that because we'd be wilding out, and I don't know. We'll see. But for now, we're gonna go to Starbucks, and then we're gonna go to Sephora. Can I get a grande um, sugar cookie latte with oat milk? Um, and that should be the hotter ice. Ice. All right, anything else? That's it. All right, you see you Thank you. Y'all, my hair looks so good. Why does my hair look so good? Like, what's going on? First of all, it feels so, I have a shadow. It feels really good outside. It's 71 degrees outside. Like, I wish I had plans. Hopefully we go brunch tomorrow because it's giving I need to be outside. I have a question. So, I know Tory Lanez was convicted of, you know, Meg and we don't support him however can i still listen to his music because i'm not gonna lie playboy is his best album and that album i think low-key i think is, a, is about megan kelsey but i his music is good y'all i'm sorry like i'm still gonna listen to it don't judge me i do not support anything that he does he did and you know he was convicted and found guilty and he should you know serve out his jail time or whatever but that music is undeniable. I'm sorry. I was a Tory fan before all the bullshit. So it's like, I don't want to stop listening to the music. So, I'm just in the mood. Like, I just be wanting to turn on. Also, why is Party Next Door not on um, Apple Music or Spotify right now? Does anybody know? By the time this video goes up, maybe he'll be back on. But I saw on TikTok people were talking about how Party Next Door was taken off of like streaming platforms. And I'm like, why? What happened? <laughs> Uh, yeah, no almond milk. It was hotter as ice. ice. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yeah. Bag secured. What's up, gang? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. What's up, y'all? It is Tuesday afternoon. I know I haven't vlogged in like the past couple of days, but honestly, I haven't really done much. But I did want to update you guys. Let me get better lighting. So your girl got her iPad. <laughs> Okay, and let me tell you how my mama was supposed to bring it out here, but she forgot it. So I literally had to drive back to Fort Worth and go get it. But yeah, your girl got her iPad. Um, I didn't do an unboxing because I was just so excited. Like I didn't vlog, I didn't film, I didn't do any of that. Also because I was at my mom's house and I didn't have my camera with me. So I've been using it for the past, when did I get it, yesterday? Past 24 hours and I am already obsessed. So I'm gonna probably all up and show y'all a couple of things that I've been working on. Also, it's three o'clock, so I get off in um, a few hours. This is my first day back to work since our break. I was off, what day was I off? I was off the 23rd through January 2nd. So first day back to work and it is draining because I've been off for like 10 days. But here she is. I have fingerprints all on it. Oh, that looks really bad. <laughs> I need to get a screen protector for it because that's just absolutely crazy how my fingerprints are all over it but that's okay I'm also gonna get the little like squeegee thing to like clean it um but yeah this is the picture that I have on it right here it's 
what it's looking like. And then I yesterday made it as aesthetically pleasing as I could with until I got ready to go to bed. So this is what it looks like right now. Super cute. That's the home screen. And then we have like all my other apps and stuff. And then the next page I need to work on. But I was working on that. So tonight we're gonna do our vision board. I think I'm gonna film that for you guys. I'm gonna show you guys how I do it on my vlog. And then um, I did start digital planning, which I'm super excited. So I got this case from Amazon and then I got um, this stylus. This is not the Apple pen. I'm going to get the Apple pen. I just didn't feel like spending $100 on a pen at the time. So I was like, I'll just get something to hold me over until I do feel like spending that money. So that's what I have now. And then we already started our digital planning. I did not know that digital planning was going to be as, um, not annoying, but as tedious as it was. I was like, oh my God, this is a lot of work. So I was at a coffee shop with my friend um, earlier and I was doing work as well as I wanted to start digital planning for the month because I just wanted to kind of get the hang of it. So literally it took me three hours to, it took me an hour and a half to get this done. Y'all see how there's nothing on here? But I had to download the planner, um, download the font that I have, figure out how to like maneuver. So hopefully it doesn't take me as long um, to work through this later. But yeah, I was like, oh, this is crazy. Also, I need to order a screen protector for it. Um, I'm gonna get the paper screen protector. If y'all don't know what that is, um, I didn't find out about it till I was watching a um, digital planning video and you can get a protector that goes over your screen that feels like you're writing on paper. That way, you know, like right now my pen is kind of slippery because of the way the screen is. Um, but that way it just feels like you're writing on paper, feels like you're writing on a notebook. So the digital planning has started. We started it out. Um, I'm gonna do some TikTok videos on that because I've already, since I posted on my iPad, I've already gotten like People being like, oh, what are you going to do on it? Like, we're going to digital plan. Can you post videos? So I'm going to work on that. And then, yeah, she's an iPad girly. I just feel like I got my life together. Um. Anyways, I also, dang, a lot has happened since I last talked to y'all. We also have a package over here. So your girl got her Uggs. So we're going to open them up, make sure nothing's wrong with them. But um, after I got back from Nordstrom, um, literally the next day the Uggs restock to my size, so we got us some Uggs. They put them in a big old box. Oh, uh, I'm so happy. Because I was so sad about my Uggs. And shout out to Nordstrom for accommodating me. Let's just say that because I was so nervous. I was like, they're not going to take these back. But I was like, I have the receipt, so they should take them back. Like, I just want to exchange them. I need my money back. They don't have a thing. These look a little dented. Now, uh, I don't know if this is a Nordstrom thing or not, but they know they could have put the little um thingy in here so they could stand up. Cause these look a little run down. Like they look new, but they look like they've um look a little like not not new. They look a little like I'm trying to explain it. Have bad luck with us, y'all. They look flat, like they don't look stiff. You know when they put the insert in the shoe so you can tell like it's stiff? That's not what this is giving. But I mean, they're out there fine. It's probably okay. I'm just trying to make sure they don't look like they've been worn or anything, but. Honestly, all the bad luck that I've had with Uggs, I don't even feel like having the hassle of sending them back and reordering them. And also, they're super hard to get, so they look as new as they're gonna get. So I ain't tripping. Uggs are like $200. For $200, baby, I need some type of shoe insert. I don't know, I just think the quality of Uggs now has gone down in comparison to how they used to be. Because I had my old pair of Uggs for like years, like literally, the only reason I wanted another pair is because they were so dirty. And I mean, I could have sent them off to get clean, but I was like, it's just time to have them. And I bought those like my freshman year of college. I had them up until, I had them for about almost when I graduated. I got a new pair either 
Honestly, I think it was my graduation year. So for about four years and they were fine. And then I feel like I've gotten these new ones and they just haven't been, you know. They need to be. Oh, well, that's cool. Your girl got her husband back. So anyways, I'm about to chill, um, finish up some work, and then I'm going to go to the gym. I may or may not take you guys with me. We'll see. I don't know if y'all want to see my gym routine. I'm just going to be doing some, like, walking on the incline today because I didn't work out last week. I know. Um... But yeah, I'll check in with y'all later. Y'all, I'm so happy I got this tripod because I can prop y'all up a lot higher whenever I'm doing unboxing. So we're doing a little jewelry unboxing. I also have to film a um, unboxing for Glow Girl. Oh, hold on. My camera probably crooked. Okay. Sorry, y'all. I figured out why it's crooked. But yeah, we're doing a jewelry unboxing. And then I also have to film a quick unboxing for Glow Girl. They sent over some new jewelry pieces. I'll show you guys. After I do the unboxing, I have to do a um, get ready for them as well. We're gonna unbox our package from Her Folk Thugs. Y'all are gonna be so excited when y'all see this. Y'all look at this. Let me open it up. So as you can see, it is a Van Cleef dupe. I get all of my like um, dupes from Her Folk Lux. All of my like luxury dupes, that's where I get all of them. But yeah, oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Now I want the other one. She has a black one on the side. This is gorgeous. And the quality of these her, her bleh, quality of these Herfold Lux pieces is so amazing. I don't know if you guys can see. But yeah, it's so pretty. Uh-oh. OG YouTuber with the hand. Oh my gosh, it's gorgeous. Girl. I'm obsessed. It looks so good. Um, but yeah, we're gonna I'm gonna prop you guys up and we're gonna film an unboxing so you guys can kind of Kind of get an idea how I'm going to do it. Um, but yeah, I want the black version of this. This is so cute. Okay, let me... Y'all probably can't see nothing that's going on. <laughs> oh, let me see. Let me make y'all shorter. Y'all should be able to see. So first for this, I'm going to take some pictures. Um, just because I'm going to get like aesthetic pictures for if I do any story posts or anything. So we're gonna do that. Plus this helps with thumbnails and things like that. So I always take like cute little aesthetic pictures. Only thing about taking pictures here is that there's a glare because of the light, but what can you do? That's done. We're gonna open one up. Which, what is this? Okay, this is the necklace. So cute! Okay, I'm gonna sh let me see if I can show y'all because the camera's angled very awkwardly. Oh, it's crooked. This tripod. <laughs> it's tripod. Sorry, y'all. I'm sure y'all are crooked, but this is what the picture looks like. It's the first picture. That's the other picture of the boxes. And yeah, so we're gonna do the unboxing. Got my handy dandy tripod over here. The only thing is, I have to move y'all because y'all are in the frame. And then I usually have it a lot more level. Let's see. Yeah, the only thing about right here is my sink is right here. So, hmm. I really want it on the counter because it looks good. But my sink is throwing me off. So what angle can I put it? Can I block it and put the flowers here? Okay, period. Let's do it. So we're just gonna film some things happening. Ugh, this camera on this 14 is amazing. These earrings are so cute. <gasps> oh, I thought I broke it. I was like, oh no. Okay, so we're done filming the unboxing. Also, my memory card is about to run out of memory. So I'll probably check in with you guys later because Tristan made dinner. So I'm about to head to our apartment. Let me cut your